Hello YouTube. All right. So I'm actually filming this in my apartment after I went fishing today and uh, recorded everything. But I was just gonna say before you watch this that literally today's video was I was just gonna get my kayak out of my apartment. I needed to put it on top of my car, um, but I was gonna go take it out to try it for the first time. It's a lifetime Tamarack 100, um, but it literally has never been in the water. So I just wanted to go take it somewhere. And the only place I really knew about a public boat launch was Lake Dunlop. So I knew there were fish there, but I was not expecting anything to happen, honestly, and I ended up getting a pretty awesome clip, so guys, stay tuned, hope you enjoy it, and let's get into the video. What is up, guys? Um, today, I am going to go on a little bit of adventure because honestly, it is just time to get this thing out of the apartment. Yeah, just got to get out. Got to get this thing out. Gotta go in the closet, buddy. I'm sorry. I'll be back. Oh, this is fun. Alright. Luckily, this thing is only 55 pounds, so I can actually manage to carry it. Try not to bang it up too bad. Well, we got a shot down. Let's go get the gear. Most importantly, come on. Ooh. All right, guys, we have made it out here to Lake Dunlop and trying to get rigged up to go fishing first time in my kayak so just kind of figuring it out not sure what all I need to do but we're gonna get her done okay well this is about to be an adventure I know the gist of kayaking uh, I don't know all the rules honestly I have no idea if I'm completely legal I hope I am Just, uh, I guess give her a, oh, I feel like I'm going to end up in the water pretty easily. Seems stable, although I'm not all the way out yet. All right, and we're off. This kayak is not, like, crazy stable, so hopefully I can stay dry today. Time to fish though. Oh, I got a lot of learning to do. Hello, bird. All right, if I had one goal for today, well, if I had one goal, it'd be to catch something. I'm really glad I'm just out here trying out the kayak, um, or learning some water, but if I had absolutely one thing that'd be just really cool is I wanna catch a smallmouth. I haven't caught one yet since I've been in smallmouth waters. So I think it'd be really awesome if I could get one of those on the end of my line. Ooh, there's a fish under me. Guys, water is so clear. It's crazy. I'm assuming I'm just going to throw on top of one at some point. I don't know. Maybe I should be starting out with like a moving bait. Oh, 
I feel like this is gonna get slammed. This water's so clear, I feel like it's gotta be something pretty natural. Oh, what are those? Those look like giant shad. Like what? Carp? I don't, what are those? They're everywhere. All right, if you fish this water, tell me, comment and tell me what the heck the giant schools of the things that look like giant shad are. There's no way, they look, they're huge. They look like they're three pounds a piece. I doubt y'all can see them in the GoPro. Oh, I just got bit. There we go. Oh, okay. Okay, what we got? That's a good, what? Let's go. Look at that large mouth. Oh, all right, I'm having issues. Got him. Okay, I know what I'm doing from now on. That was quick. That was very quick. I mean, I can tell you. Okay, 3.30 after recording. Three minutes, 30 seconds in. Look at that largey. That's awesome. See you, dude. Let's go. Wait, my worm, no. Oh, all right, well, I gotta put another worm on, but what a start. Let's go. All right, well, I have a really good idea. This is groundbreaking stuff. I've never thought of this before. I'm going to keep the bag of Cinco's or Yum Dingers up here <laughs> so I don't have to get one every time. I do have to be careful. I've only got like two more uh, of the Yum Dingers and the Watermelon Reds, so oh, I need to quit losing baits. I might be stuck. Let's get out of here. All right, here we go. I spooked a fish over there. I ran into the Whatever that is. Oh, no, it's not a fish. Thought I saw a big one. <sighs> Man, I am, this is just, I've been thrown into the unknown. Like, I don't know <sighs> if I should be fishing something weighted on the bottom column of the water. I... But, hey, I caught a fish, so. I got a feeling I could probably catch another one. Oh, yeah. Oh, let's go. Ooh, okay, okay. Dunlop is the move. Oh, there's a big one with it. Oh, there's a big one with it. See that? That's a good one, but there's a real good one with him okay all right what oh yes 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 oh my gosh oh my gosh i would have never imagined this was gonna happen wow i hope y'all saw that big one with him i don't know which one was bigger jeez that is a nice fish wow okay that it's probably my Texas personal best one. Can... What was that? If I can reach my scale. There it is. All right. I don't even know how to use this power. There we go. There we go. Three, two. Three pounds, two ounces. Stud. Dunlop. Three pounder. See you, dude. Oh my gosh, guys.
All right, you best believe I'm going back up there. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh my. I don't, I, this is nuts. This is a world I've just been hidden from. What am I doing? What have I been doing? Oh, I've been here for like two months. All right, so I fished a good ways down the, the lake or the river, whatever you want to call it. It's technically the Guadalupe River, but it's Lake Dunlap. And I didn't really see much. I didn't get any bites. So I'm going back to where I caught those two fish, like back to back really fast. And I think I'm gonna just like throw everything I've got kind of towards that area and fish it really hard. See if we can come up with something else. I'm not gonna stay out too long today. It's just a little quick trip. I'm gonna try and be back by like, I don't know, four o'clock or something. Maybe five, maybe five o'clock. Depends on how it's going, but I'm not gonna stay out here all day. I didn't bring any sunscreen and I am feeling the sun. It is beating down. There are no clouds in the sky. So we're gonna go see what happens up here and hopefully good fish. Whew. I have to convince Carolina I do not need to go for a run tonight. This is rough. All right, so as y'all can see, I have paddled all the way back to the bridge, and now I think I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna float down and fish this left side that's like kind of protected by the shade. Um, I think that that might be where the fish are hanging out since the sky is just absolutely clear today so I'm just gonna turn around drift down and I think I'm gonna throw the wacky worm to start off so that's what we're doing Whew. that was a workout <laughs> all right well I think I'm gonna call it a day I really liked uh, Lake Dunlop as far as I've seen water is beautiful um, you can catch fish here but I'm kind of burning up and I didn't come super prepared for this. I really just want to try out the kayak, but I got an awesome bonus of catching a couple fish. One was a really good fish, the best fish I've caught in Texas so far since I moved. So pretty excited about how everything went, but I'm just going to go ahead and paddle on back now. So I'll see y'all in a minute. Of course, where you launch and put your boat out, this is where the current is the strongest, so this is fun. I'm trying to haul it up in here. I don't really know how I'm gonna do this. I'm probably gonna flip over. Uh, come on, right up in here. Yes, right up in here. Oh. Yes, sir. Phew. Yeah, mine too. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I just I just got a little cheap kayak, uh, but I just bought an expensive one. That's my first time. Well, that's that's one. what I would want, but <laughs> well, I'll probably come back here. I mean, it's got potential for sure. I know there's a lot of fish. Yeah, I saw a lot. I really did. But nice talking to you. That was a nice guy. Do we really have to go for a run? Yes! Ooh! Ooh! Yes! Okay. This is what I live with. Finn. Move the camera. Alright. Alright, so if y'all like the content, you wanna see more videos like this, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. And I'm gonna be putting out content weekly. So we'll just see how it goes, but I'm having a lot of fun so far. I definitely have a lot to learn with the editing and filming and all that stuff. So um, I'm just gonna be trying to get better as I go, but y'all hang in there with me. But yeah, I appreciate the support. So thanks for watching. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.